Thank you for hanging out with me today. This is Cage848, and welcome back to Project Castaway. So there has been an update, a pretty substantial update. We're going to go over the update notes here really quick. Actually, let's just do it right now. They've added an extension belt blueprint, giving two additional equipment slots. They've added a granite hatchet. They've added a smoker and smokehouse blueprints. They've added a fourth small island, and they've added a fishing rod. They've also done bug fixes. And they made it so raw potatoes have a low chance of giving you diarrhea and you can now cook your potatoes if you would like to eat them safely. Now, a lot of this stuff I'm not going to be able to take advantage of. Let's just take a quick look in here. Um, I believe the granite axe is in here, but I don't really need the granite axe anymore because I'm already making bronze. But um, I did mention when I got granite that it was weird there was no granite axe. So there is now a granite axe. So I could make that if I wanted to, which I won't, but... You know, it's there and it's, and it's, you know, whatever. And there's also a fishing pole. And I don't remember where the fishing pole is. It's got to be in tools, right? At the end of tools. There we go. Fishing rod. Okay. Now, all this stuff I can get except for springs. I don't know where to get springs. Springs might be when I take stuff apart, like computers or whatnot. I don't know. Or it might be something new. Now, here's the deal. I, I did not restart my world. Now, because I didn't restart my world, I don't think I can get the blueprint for most of these things, okay? But the reason I didn't restart my world was because the developer said they're planning another big update over the weekend. And I didn't want to restart my world and then restart it again three days later. So we're going to continue playing here. I'll do what I can to make what I can. I'm going to really try hard to find the springs. Um, again, I don't remember if they're in the game yet. They might have been and I just missed them. But I'm going to try really hard to make the uh, fishing rod. I would not say no to some fishing. So let's take a look what we got here now. So it doesn't seem like we have any food, which is a bit concerning. Um, yeah, I don't have anything in here. I don't think I dropped any food on the ground. Nope. All right, so this is what I'm going to do. This is what I'm going to do. I'm going to leave my bow here, okay? And I'm going to take my hammer. Uh, someone told me in the comment section, if you don't have like 10 arrows, you're not going to be able to take the, <laughs> the jaguar anyway. So I think if I see the jaguar, I either have to avoid him or I'm probably just going to die. Uh, what is this? Here we go. Uh, you die. Stupid hornet. Uh, will that thing attack me? I don't think so. All right, let's just go, let's just go ahead and start taking stuff apart. Get some loot. And it's going to be a lot of fun. I will probably be restarting my world over the weekend. And um, it's going to be great. Okay, so that's a lot of stuff right there. Nothing that looks like springs, though. Uh, I'm not seeing any springs. Maybe I'm missing them. I don't know. I don't think so. Let's keep on keeping on. So last episode, um, oh, really quickly, another thing is you can use surfboards as decoration in your bases. Uh, maybe I'll take that on the way home. So, and now I don't remember what else I was going to talk about. I wrote down a lot of stuff, by the way. Um, someone said you can hold up to 10 arrows in your backpack. You will need them for the Jaguar. Someone else said you can um, also build a palm bed and barrel stove on the corners of your raft. Someone said if you get the jaguar to chase you to the beach, you can go in the water and he won't follow you. You can kill him from a short distance. And then surfboards and signs can be placed on walls of your shelter. So that is um, good tips there. Thank you very much for that, guys. I appreciate that. Let's grab this stuff. Leave that here. Hopefully the jaguar won't be here. Because, like, yeah, the, the person I was talking to in the comment section was like, yeah, you want, like, 10 arrows to fight the jaguar or else you're probably just going to die. I was like, all right. Well, maybe I could run into the water if he attacks me. That's another option. And we just have to get some... Uh, oh, yeah, I came over here and destroyed something over here and got some plastic, I believe, at some point last episode. But then I think I died to the jaguar and didn't come back over here and get it, which is why I'm here right now. What's in the water over here? Oh, it's floating. A floating sign. Danger. High voltage. All right. You stay right there. Oh, a rusty refrigerator? Dude, this has got to have springs in it, right? Come on. Give me some springs. I see a blueprint over there right now. Give me some springs. And nothing there looks like springs. Do I really need all these bolts? Probably not. Honestly, I don't need most of this stuff, I don't think. Can I break the cooling unit? No, I cannot. Um, air filter, can't break it. All right, this is what we're going to do. I'm going to drop a bunch of stuff on the ground here because I don't even know what I would need this stuff for. I'm just clogging up my inventory with crap I already have a ton of anyway. I'll hold on to the glass because that I could, I could use. I don't know if I need a hornet. Just drop this stupid hornet on the ground. Um, <laughs> just, drop, just drop that stupid hornet. No big deal. 
It'd be nice if this was quicker, by the way. Yeah, one of my uh, one of the things I was asking for most in this game was more hotkey slots. And uh, yeah, the next update, they gave us more hotkey slots. I do appreciate that. That is good development in my humble opinion. Alright, what is this? Uh, blueprint. Elite bird snare. Okay. Very good. And is there anything else over here I can... Get? Oh, hold on. Oh, hold on. that's the wrong thing. There we go. Got my bronze axe, baby. Alright, take that stuff. It's normal stuff, but whatever. Okay, I don't know. I thought there was a computer or something. Where I don't know. I'm, maybe I'm getting confused. What is that? Oh, that's like a Black Widow or something. Get out of here. Dude, he's just attacking me over and over. A Black Widow should really mess you up. I'm glad it didn't, but... <laughs> That is, uh, that is a bad, bad spider. Man, there's spiders all over the freaking place. Alright, I thought there was a computer over here. I might be mistaken, or I might just be missing it. I really don't know. But I don't want to spend all my time over here, so let's go explore the rest of the island. Oh, there, is that it? Oh, there we go. Yeah, I passed it. Fair enough. Nope, don't care about any of this stuff. There's the plastic I was looking for. Take the glass. Nope, the rest isn't any good. I don't know, man. I don't know if there was, uh... I, I, what do you call it? Not I keep wanting to say screws. Uh, springs. I don't know if there were springs in the game before. I don't remember picking any up, but I might have just overlooked it when I was picking stuff up. There's a lot of stuff in this game that doesn't seem to have a lot of uses. Or at least not that I know. Not that I'm aware of. Snail. Yes, sir. And let's just go ahead and eat that right now. Where'd it go? No, seriously, where the heck did it go? Um, I did pick it up, didn't I? Whatever. <laughs> I'll look for it later. I'm just gonna leave a lot of stuff. I really don't need, like... I guess I can use sticks. Uh, let's go down this way first. I think we're just going to look, take a look around the rest of this island. We'll probably head to the next island. Or back to the original island that I didn't finish looting last time I was there. But I would like to clear this one out first. Or at least most of it. And see what we got going on. Is that thing follow me? No, but it's right in my way. Nope, we're good. We're good. That. And these. What is that? Oh, an old TV. Okay. You got for me, old TV. A lot of glass in the game. Take all the plastic, I guess. And there's the surfboard. More bug spray. Uh, one of the things I did see in the update notes is that they, um, I didn't mention it, but they lowered the amount of bug spray that would be on, like, around, so. Okay, seriously, where did that, where did that snail go? Why am I not seeing it? So my sticks are full, but I still have room in my bag, and no, I still couldn't find the snail. So, it is what it is. Let's go around, look it around, see what else we got over here. I don't even know if this stuff's worth, like, breaking anymore. Like, I don't really even need anything from it. Yeah, see, I don't need an air filter. I don't need a cooling unit. I don't need all that metal. Or at least I don't need it right now. Oh, old sofa. Oh, this should have some springs in it, right? Maybe. Nope, but I will take the leather. And the foam. I don't know what I would really need the foam for, but I might as well take it. I need it for something at some point. Maybe something to help float. Maybe not a raft, but float something else in the water. Surfboard. All right. I'm not seeing... Oh, do I really need to even break that? Wait a minute. My hammer broke. And it's gone. Mm. I, for a minute, it said broken hammer. 
So I was hoping, like, it would still be in there. Yeah, if stuff breaks, it's just stay in your inventory. Okay, I guess I'm gonna head back to base. Uh, well, you know, I'll explore the rest of the island as I head back as I head back to camp. Um, yeah, I mean that was that was simply a um, uh, a stone hammer, which you know I don't like to let my stone hammer break, but whatever. I guess it's not the end of the world, but yeah, I I can't stand like I, I know what you're gonna say, Cage. Just pay attention. It's hard, man. It's not something I really. It's not something I notice, you know. So I hope they change that so when stuff breaks, it does it doesn't go away, and it gives you a chance to you know repair it at some point. But we'll have to see where they go with it. Uh, we got to go down here to the left. I'll probably just go through the water. It just looks like it's like ankle deep, maybe up to my shins or my waist or my chest. But <laughs> I didn't have to swim, so that's all that matters. Okay. Let's look around over here. I think we've seen just about everything there is to see on this island, as far as I can tell. Um, if there's stuff I missed, I will, you know, come back, but... I don't know, I'm not really seeing anything too interesting here. A lot of loot. A lot of loot I will probably need at some point, but just, you know, not right now. There. What do we have over here? Nothing? All right. Just looking around. I think we're going to head back to that island after I'm done here. I'll um, pack up all the stuff that's important to me, and we'll head over there. Actually, it's probably good that that hammer... Well, I, I guess maybe it's not good. Uh, see, the hammer broke, but now like my inventory slot is open for the bow, which I will want to take back with me. No, I don't want to leave the bow here. So it's like, okay, well, the fact that the hammer broke is probably pretty good, because now I have a space for the bow. But the thing is, I could have just left the hammer here and had it next time I came here. So, no, there's really no good point to the hammer breaking. But that's okay. Not the end of the world. It's just a stick and a, and a piece of stone. Not a big deal. Alright, looks like we are just about... I never went in there, but usually all the all the loot's on the outside. I guess I could go on the inside and kind of look around, but look on the inside of the island and look around, but it seems like it's mostly on the outside. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to go save the game. And then we'll go look in there. And then I'm going to gather everything. We'll go to uh, the other island. There's only three islands, but they're adding more. That's why I'm looking forward to the weekend update. They said they're going to add a few more islands on the weekend update. So I didn't really want to like restart the game and be like, okay, I restarted the game and then on Wednesday. And then Saturday, they did another update that forced me to restart the game again. Police. Yeah, not too bad. Not too bad at all. So I'm pretty hungry, and I'm uh, breaking down some banana trees and, and some getting some coconuts and everything. And I just noticed there's a little area over here I want to show you. I'm glad I actually found this before I left, man. This would have bothered me if I <laughs> left without showing this to you guys. It looks like a little plane crashed, and they made a little, um, I don't know, like a little outpost over there. Here it is. All right, so what is this all about? Oh, okay. Oh, oh, it's actually in the game. Okay, that changes everything. That changes everything. Well, unless I can't make it. I assumed when I, when I, when I, you know, after the update and I decided not to restart, I just assumed if I didn't restart, I wasn't going to get any of the new stuff. That's one of the new things. So, um, oh boy, look at all that. Let's go save the game. Well, I think we're pretty safe over here for, uh, you know, the time being. I wish I could shoot them with this cannon. That'd be freaking awesome. I'm not noticing anything else over here. You gotta be careful. You gotta be careful. Uh, yeah, that's 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 awesome. Uh, it depends on what we need to make the smokehouse. If I have what I need to make the smokehouse, I'm going home, and we're making the smokehouse. That's it. What were the what were the two items that they first? Uh, what were the two new items? Um, smoker and smokehouse. I don't know which one's better, but I got the smokehouse. So let's take a look at it. Um, that's the elite bird. Oh, I probably should go home and set up elite bird snares and stuff. Um, elite smoke house. Smoke. Oh, smoke meat to cook it slower and make it. Dude, dude, that's what we're doing. We're going home for that. Right, I'm going to pick that up. We're going to save the game. Let's see what kind of stuff we'd like to take home with us. I'd like to take Wilson, but it might be hard. I don't know if you can carry something home like that. We'll have to see. Uh, we definitely need the plastic. 
we want the leather. We want the... Uh, that's all rotten, so who cares? I don't really care much about tea, to be honest. Uh, wool spiders. Yeah, I don't know if there's... Where's the glass? I know I threw glass on the ground, but it's so hard to see glass. I guess I'll take the rope. We definitely could use rope. Yeah. I'm not really sure where the glass is. I know I threw glass on the ground. I just don't see it. Oh, there it is. All right, cool. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab everything that's important to me. Uh, I think that's probably most of it. And we are just going to go home now. I will try and take Wilson with me. Go ahead and save the game. When I come back here, um, I would like to... I, I mean, I don't know if I'll come back here. I guess I could. I don't know if there's a reason to come back here, to be honest. But if I end up coming back here, I will come back here with uh, 10 arrows. Uh, that way, if I have to fight that Jaguar, I have a chance. And let's see how this is going to go. I don't think this is going to work. Hmm. I guess I can just leave this here. See, I don't know if I can get much... Well, I, I should be able to get closer. Yeah, I'd like to take Wilson with me if I can. Yeah, I can take Wilson with me. But we need to kind of turn this around. And then hop up on this. There we go. And we need to turn this way. Beautiful. Beautiful, guys. We're going home. We are going home. Somebody said if you duck, you can see. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you can see if you duck. Beautiful. So let's turn that a little bit. There we go. That should be head on. And we're heading home, and we're going to make the smoker. I'm so glad I found the smoker. I was very upset. Like, not really upset. I, I understand, like, the way it's working, and I, I think my decisions are sound. Because, like I said, starting the game on Wednesday, over the weekend, have started another game. That doesn't make any sense. But I was still, like, disappointed that I didn't think I was going to be able to make any of the new items. Uh, the smokehouse and the belt are the two things I really wanted to make. Um, if I could have any choice, one item, out of the update that I could make, this is definitely... Definitely the one. I am home and I'm pretty hungry, but I wanted to make the meat smokehouse. And you can make it inside. Oh, I'm so happy you can make that inside. Three, four, five. That is really cool. Because, like, I was very disappointed you couldn't make anything inside your bases. But now you can, well, at least with this thing. I don't know. Maybe you can make other things as well. Um, very well could be the case. So, all right. So, we need to add sticks. Um, I don't have any sticks. Start the fire. And it looks like we could fit, what, um, six pieces of meat on there? So let's come out here. I don't know if I have any sticks in the immediate area. But I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to come up here. Chop down a tree. I, maybe I don't want to make the logs and the sticks. Hold on. This will work. There we go. And boom. Okay, so we've got a couple of sticks there. I don't know how many, how many sticks I would have to put in this thing. Um, in order to make it, like, you know, cook. Uh, I don't know if you have to put all the sticks in. I have no idea. This is obviously brand new, so. Man, it should be pretty good. Let's come on down here and let's do the smoke. I might have to cook some of the meat, though. Uh, my food my food is a real problem. I don't know how long I'll take the smoke. But I'd imagine it would take a good amount of time. So, it might be a good idea to uh, not rely on that completely. And three. All right. Now, since I was gone for so long, all my traps have food in them, which is really, really nice. Not going to lie. And I'm not going to take the feathers until I need to. I don't think I took the feathers last time, which means we believe they disappear after a while, which would be nice. And then we got that. Should have plenty of room in our inventory for everything. Got this one. Now, don't forget, I have, like, new advanced, like, traps and everything and elite traps and all kinds of, all kinds of craziness. Uh, I'm going to actually come over here and get the bird carcass from this trap as well. And then we're going to be off to the races. Uh, it takes a lot of food to fill you up once you get this hungry, by the way. It's not like you just need a couple pieces and you're good to go. Hold on. Come on. Come on. Come on. There we go. That, set that, make sure we don't have anything down here that we need. Okay, I don't see anything there I need. I'm not sure, I, I'm I'm like 85 or 90% sure I have not seen a spring yet in the game. So, I'm. A, they might have just added that in that update. Okay. So, I don't know how many...
many sticks I want to put in there. So I just guess I'll just put like, um, I don't know, one more. I really have no clue. No. Yeah. Cool. All right. And one more. And let's go ahead and start this bad mamma jamma. It should tell you if you need more, like, sticks and stuff, you know? But, uh, 13, oh, 13 hours. Okay. So does that mean it's going to go for 13 hours or it's going to take 13 hours? I'm only getting one thing, so I'm not really... Yep, that's how long it'll go for. Okay. So 14 hours. I don't know how long it takes to smoke the meat, though. Doesn't really matter, though. We're also going to have to do some cooking here. And hopefully I see the decent amount of meat left because I am... Starving. Yeah, we got a decent amount left. I mean, an okay amount. By the way, I made a um, pesticide container. It, it wasn't exactly done the way I thought it was going to be done. So, we got a pesticide container. Now, I don't know what caused my crops to die last time. I'm going to be honest because, like, I, I don't feel like they should have died. Like, I put... I guess they could die from the bugs. That's the only thing I could think of. The thing is, I had pests in my, in my you know... Uh, grow plots quite often and they never died from the bugs until they did I guess We're Still gonna need more food All right Yeah, that's gonna take the whole you probably have to put like all the sticks in there for that So somebody said that there was um sticks up in here or like there's a bush up in here that um, I could plant To get sticks. Yeah, this right here. I could plant that to get sticks but I'm going to not plant that just yet because I don't want to screw it up. Um, I would like to learn a little bit more about farming. And I want basically what the thing is, guys, I want to know I can farm without losing the crops before I get those berries. So I'm going to work on the farming a little bit more. Let's go ahead and put down the torch, grab the spade. I'm just going to go ahead and take this apart really quick because I can. And there's really no reason... Not to. Uh, tools. Spade. Granite. I should, go, I should get a granite spade. Eh, it doesn't matter. It's like you need a great spade. This thing works just fine. So that one's looking good. Okay. All right. We need to get, we need to get some more potatoes. I'm going to work on the potatoes. And somebody said if you like, if you put manure or whatever, or not manure, but if you fertilize the potatoes, you'll get a bunch of them. It's not the case. I fertilize my potatoes every time, and the best I can get is two potatoes. Potatoes. All right. And now we need to... Oops. Hold on. There we go. One. And two. And then we need to keep an eye on it, and if we have any pest issues... I'm hoping I can get rid of it with my uh, pesticide. Oops. Will the potatoes go bad? Good question. I don't know. I would imagine they would. Uh, so I think maybe you want to ex expand this a little bit. How about that? Right there. Go back. Uh, it's a regular farming plot. There and let's put another one down too. Come on, there you go. All right, we just need some logs. I know I have some logs by the beach. Let's get those made and plant some more potatoes. I went ahead and finished those two farm plots and planted two more potatoes. And I do now want to finish this. There we go. All right, so how do I put stuff on there? We'll get to the farm plots in a moment. Um, but right now I just want to kind of. Hang up some leather, see what we could do with it. And no animal hide. Do I have to like drag it on there? Oh. Tanned animal. Wait. Oh, so I got leather already. Oh, okay. Alright. Well, I guess you get animal hide from the animals. And then the leather from the leather from the couches, I'll bet. Okay. Alright. Fair enough. So I went ahead and made this thing. Pesticide container, a spray container for pesticides. Then I went ahead and planted some more crops, and I've got pests on two of the three crops. But I don't know how to use the pesticide container. I go ahead and drop it on there, and nothing happens. 
So either it's not implemented yet, or maybe I have to, maybe this is just a container and now I need to make the pesticide to put in the container, but I have no idea how. So right now farming is a, I don't know. I, I've had some, I've had some uh, luck with the banana tree, but this stuff, like, I don't know, the sticks are going to be a problem. Although I do have a ton of trees on this island. So, and even more trees on other islands. But as far as growing something for sticks, I don't see how that's really feasible at this point. Maybe, I, I don't know. I don't know. If, the, if this, if the stuff doesn't die, then maybe it's not that big of a deal. We'll have to see. We'll have to see. We'll play around with it. We will definitely play around with it. How's the smoker doing? Uh, Wait, is it done? Um, oh, I guess it is. No, that's crab arm, but it doesn't say raw. Crab arm. Is it smoked or not? I don't see the thing anymore. I thought it would have said smoked crab arm. Let's go ahead and sleep. <laughs> or, sorry, let's go ahead and save. And then we're going to eat it and see if it poisons us. No, that looks pretty good. Now, I wonder if we get more actual... I really wish I could put this out, by the way. So, how many things can this hold? Okay. So, we needed about... What did I put that at? 15 hours? You, I would say you probably need about 7 or 8 hours to smoke stuff, I guess. It's, it's as far as I can tell. Um, I would also like some, some indication to tell me how long I have before the item goes bad. Like, I don't have enough information to make any informed decisions here on what I would like to eat and save. So, I'm going to go ahead and... Take that. Anything in here? Yep. Cool, cool. Nope, nothing in there. Grab this one, and let's go down there and see if we've got another bird down there. I'm going to spend some time between this and next video and start saving up resources for things like, uh, you know, elite bird snares. See, I don't know what the difference is between an elite bird snare and an advanced bird cage. An easy way to catch birds with higher possibility than normal bird snare. An easy way to catch birds with higher possibility than normal bird snare. So I don't know which one of these is best. I'll probably just make one of each just because I can. And also, uh, next episode, I would like to make the advanced crab trap and the elite crab trap. That will be really awesome. But for now, let's get some more sm let's get some more smoking going and see if we can get done here. Yep, there's a bird. All right, come to Papa. And, uh, yeah, I really want information about how long things are going to last. Like, cooked bird meat will last this long. Smoked bird meat will last this long. I'd like to, I'd like to know. Because otherwise, I'm just going to, like... It, it, this stuff might go bad, you know? And I don't really know. So, okay. So, we got seven hours left. Okay. So, we got almost eight hours left. Let's go ahead and put these on here and see if they smoke up within that seven or eight hours. Crab arm, crab arm. See, now, are those the cooked ones? Are the smoked ones? I don't... I can't tell. Um, that's definitely raw. And the other things I'm not so sure about. I guess I'll just cook everything. And from now on, when I smoke something, I'll just put it somewhere. And, like, maybe I'll have, like, a little smoked food pile or something. Uh, am I going to be able to live through that, whatever, whatever I have down here? Should we try and sleep through it? Let's try and sleep through it. Why not? Sleep for a good... Let's just sleep for eight hours. We're either going to be fine or we're not going to wake up. And we're fine. All right, cool. So we did live through it. Uh, this stuff is not done yet. And we still have three hours and 25 minutes. All right, guys. I do think I'm going to call this one here. If you ended up enjoying the video, please remember to uncage that like button. Also, if you're new here... Please subscribe for more daily videos. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. And until then, take it easy.